and roll four on the ladders today. Once you have done your 10 leg swings front and back. Feel free to hold on to something if you need to. We'll do 10 swings on each leg. Find a focal point for those eyes that will help with your balance. Keeping those abs nice and tight. Again, 10 on the left, 10 on the right. Just getting that hip a little bit more warmed up, ready to rock and roll. And once you have done 10, we're going to come down on the floor on your mat. High plank or push up position. Going into a spider climb and then rotating that same arm up towards the ceiling. Opening up through the shoulder, chest, and the hip. So step the foot wide. Open it up. Make sure those eyes fall the hand to the ceiling. We're going to do 10 total. So five on the left, five on the right. And once you have done your 10, stay down in your plank position. And we'll finish off with either 10 plank toe taps or 10 plank jacks. So you choose either jump or step the feet out to the side, 10 total, and then we are going to rock and roll with ladder number one. So how our ladders are going to go down today is we're going to start with two reps, then four, six, eight, and 10. And then we're going to grab a drink and we're going to move on to the next one. So I'm going to need two dumbbells, one on each shoulder. So we're in this front loaded position and we're going to do one front lunge, one front lunge. So there's your two reps. Move number two, down on the floor, one dumbbell. Plank, dumbbell, pull throughs, one per side. There's your two reps. Then we stay down for two push-ups either off the knees or the toes, we stand back up. One dumbbell or kettlebell, we're going to clean and overhead press once per side, there's your two reps. And then we go back to the top and go for four. So, grab two dumbbells for me. So the weights are for the lunges and the pull-throughs, as well as the clean to overhead press. So whether you use the same weight for everything or have a couple of different weights, I'm going to leave that up to you. All right, you ready? There's no timer to go off. So, one, one, front lunges. Here we go. We got one, we got two. Hit the deck. Plank, dumbbell, pull throughs. Knees or toes, reach under the body. Pull to one side. Pull to the other. Two push ups. Here we go. One, two. Come on up. Grab a dumbbell or a kettlebell. Clean and press, one per side. Clean it up, get that bicep to ear. Switching hands at the bottom, clean and press. We are back to the top, back to those front lunges. We got four total, here it is. One, two, three, last one, hit the deck. Plank, dumbbell pull throughs, two. Knees or toes. 
Move number two, lateral shoulder raises. Move number three, deadlifts. Move number four, overhead tricep extensions. Okay, so we're gonna start with the sumo squat. Grab your weight for me. Whether you're using dumbbells or kettlebells, I'll leave that up to you. Let's get those feet nice and wide. So slightly turned out. Shoulders pulled back. We got two. Here it is. One. And two. Bring those feet back together. Make the weight change. Lateral raises. Here it is. One. Woo. Two. Deadlifts. Let's bring those weights in front. Shoulders back. Knees soft. Push that butt out. Stand up nice and tall. Good. One more. Feel that stretch in the hamstring. You got it. Overhead. Tricep extensions. One dumbbell or two. Weight up. Elbows in. One. And two. Perfect. We got four. Setting up with those sumos. Feet wide. Toes out. Here it is. Four. Push those knees out. Three. Squeeze that butt of the way up. One more. Lateral raises. We got four. Get parallel with the floor. Four tight. Arms as straight as you can get them without blocking the elbows. One more. Come on. Dead legs. You got it. Wait in front. Roll those shoulders back. We got four. Squeeze that butt on the way up. Three. Make sure you're shaking the legs with your weight. Good. We got one more. Overhead. Tricep extensions coming up next. One dumbbell or two. Tuck those elbows in. Four. Three. Two. Last one. Back to those sumos. We've got six. Feet wide. Toes slightly turned out. Shoulders back. Here we go. Six. Five. See if you can sink a little deeper into that squat. Three more. Three. Last two. One more lateral raises. Woo, we'll see how much longer I can do this. Wait, here we go. Six. Five. Four. Lock in that tall posture. Three. Do not swing those weights. Two. One more, one more. Come on. Perfect. Deadlifts. Pull those shoulders back. Soften the knees. Here we go. Six. Aiming for those shoelaces. Five. Weights are close to the legs. Eyes are up. Three down, three to go. Overhead triceps coming up next. Two dumbbells or one. Remember, you can change your weight up as you go along. You don't have to stick with the same weight the whole time. Here it is. Six. Five. Four. Good. Three. Keep that core tight. Two. One more, one more. And we got eight. Back to that sumo. Feet are wide. Toes slightly turned out. One dumbbell or two. Here it is. Eight. Seven. Good. Push those knees out. Five. Squeeze that butt on the way up. Three more. Three. Two. One more, one more. We got those lateral raises. Make a weight change if you need to. Woo, here we go. Eight. Seven. Good. Six. Core tight. Five. Eyes are up. Four. You got it. Come on. Three. Almost there. Two. One more, one more. Back to that deadlift. Make a weight change if you need to. Knees soft. Pull those shoulders back. Here we go. Eight. Get that nice stretch in the hamstring. Squeeze that butt on the way up. Keeping that core tight. Woo, four down, four to go. Four. Three. Two, one more, one more. You got it, let's go back into those overhead tricep extensions. We got eight. Tuck those elbows in, tighten up that core. Eight. Seven. Six. Nice. Five. Four. Three. Two. One more. Last round. We are going for ten. Back with those sumos. Feet are wide. Turn those toes out slightly. Grab your weight. 
Roll those shoulders back. Here we go. 10, 9, 8, good. 7, 6, sit as deep as you can. Good, 4 more. 4, 3, more tight, eyes up. 2, one more. Lateral raises, make a quick weight change if you need to. Tighten up that core, here it is. 10, 9, whew, 8, 7, don't swing those weights up, come on, 6, 5, 4, come on, only 3 more, let's go, 3, 2, last one, last one, last one, whole burn, baby burn, we got those deadlifts, set yourself up, here we go, 10, push those hips back, Eyes are up. I want that nice neutral spine as you come down towards those shoes. Shaving the leg with those weights. Nice. Feel that stretch in the hamstring. We're going to do five more. Five. Four. Keep that core tight to support the back. Three. Last two. Come on. We only have triceps left. Two. And one. Perfect. Bring that weight behind your head. Tuck those elbows in. Tighten up that posture. Here we go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. That's it. Four. Three. Two more. Two more. Come on. Two. And grab some water. Job well done. Two ladders down. Two ladders to go. Starting with some curtsy lunges. Now you can have two dumbbells, one or none. You choose. We'll do a mix. Start with weight and drop the weight as you go along. Curtsy lunges. So that's a one, that's a two. Then we're down on the floor. Abdominal leg raises for two. Russian twist for two. Renegade rows for two. So we got three moves down on the floor. So Make sure you are ready to rock and roll with your mat for that. Okay, curtsies, you ready? One left, one right, and then we hit the deck. Here we go. Curtsy, and curtsy. Good, abdominal leg raises. Get those feet up, tuck those hands under the hips. Push your back down into the mat, lower the legs. Use those abs to pull legs back up. More. Awesome. Russian twist. Feet either on or off the floor. Here we go. One, two. Flip it over. We have our renegade rows. Take some time. Set yourself up. One left, one right. Here we go. Row, row. Awesome. Come on up. We're going to go back to your curtsies. Four total. Here it is. Four. Three, dropping that back knee down as much as you can. One more, hit the deck. Lateral, I'm oh sorry, lateral. Abdominal leg raises. Four leg raises, four Russian twists. Here we go, push that back down into the mat. We got four. Think about what those abs are doing as you pull those legs back up towards the ceiling. Once you have done four, you got that Russian twist. Feet either on or off the floor. Engage those abs again. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Renegade rows. Four total. Two left, two right. Set yourself up. Hips parallel with the floor. Abs are tight. Here we go. Four, three, two, and one. Come on up. Curtis. We got six. Here it is. Six. Five. So you can get a little deeper into that lunge. Good. Two more. One and two. Hit the deck. We got those leg raises for four or six, sorry, and then Russian twist for six. Push that back down. Here we go. Six. Just lower the legs down as far as it's comfortable for you. You do not have to bring them right down to the floor. Two left. Really think about what those abdominals are doing as you pull those legs back up to the ceiling. Six Russian twists. Three per side. Here it is. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Renegade rows. Three on the left. 
Three on the right, take your time, set yourself up. Shoulders over the wrist, core tight, here it is, six. Five, four, get those feet wide, three. Same thing from the knees, two. And one, perfect, come on up. We've got eight, four and four, here we go, 13 lunge. Eight, seven, good, six, five, four, you got it, three, two, one more. We got those abdominal leg raises for eight, Woo. and then brush and twist. Hands under those hips, back into the mat, here it is. Eight, seven, good, six, five, think about what those abs are doing, four, last three, two, one more, one more, perfect, come on up, we got that brush and twist, four per side, lean it back, <laughs> feet either on or off the floor, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, renegade rows, four on the left, four on the right, take the time, set yourself up, nice strong plank position, knees or toes, here we go, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, we got our last round, starting with those curtsies, we got ten total, five left, five right, here we go, ten, nine, eight, keep that tall posture, last six, dropping that back knee down, four more, come on, four, Three, last two, and one, hit the deck. 10 leg raises, followed by 10 Russian twists. Push your back down into the mat, here we go. 10, think about what those abs are doing. Use those abdominals to pull those legs back up to your ceiling, come on. Make them work. Five down, five to go. Russian twist, coming up. You got it, three more, three more. Three. Two. Good, grab that weight for the Russian twist. Feet either on or off the floor. Lean it back, tuck that pelvis in. Here we go, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, and one. Perfect. All right, renegade bros, flip it over. Five on each side. Get yourself set up. Strong plank position. Knees your toes. Here we go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One more. One more. Excellent. Nice work. Come on up. Grab a quick drink. We're going to move on. Now, if you have kettlebells at home, feel free to grab them. If not, dumbbells work. We're going to start with a swing. So we're going to do two dumbbell and kettlebell swings, followed by two plank walkouts, followed by two squats with or without a weight. Followed by two, one on the left, one on the right, a little mountain climber crunch, and this is how it's gonna look. So we're on our hands, we're on our toes. As you drive that knee into the chest, I want you to arc or arch the back up and draw the belly button into the spine. So we're gonna pull the knee in, arch it up, set it down. Arch it up, set it down. So it is slow, it is controlled, and you've got to focus on what those abdominals are doing. Okay, so let's start with the swings. Dumbbell or kettlebell. We got two of them. Get yourself set up. Knee soft. Push those hips back. Chest up. Here it is. High pass. One and two. Perfect. Good. Plank. 
plank, walk out for two. Wider feet, easy on those hamstrings. Here we go, walk it out to plank. Just touch those toes, walk it out again. Perfect, once you've done two, we are going to do two squats, with or without weight, you choose. Here it is. One, two, perfect, get those out of the way. Mountain climber crunch, one left, one right, set it up. Draw that belly button in, set it back, one more. Pull it in, perfect, let's go back to those swings. We got four of them, knees soft, hips back. Here we go, I pass, four. Three, keep those eyes up. Two, our back walk out. Again, narrow feet harder, wider feet, better for those hamstrings. Here we go, walk out. Keep your eyes on the floor. Belly button pulled up in the spine. You want to support that lower back. Walking out into that nice, strong plank position. Do not let those hips drop. Come on, lock it in. One more for four. And then four squats. With or without weight. Woo. Four squats. And then four mountain climber crunches. Four. Three. Good. Eyes up. Two. Sit those hips back. Perfect. All right. Two left. Two right. Here it is. Draw that belly button up. Set it back. Draw it in. Two more. Oh, last time. You got it. Perfect. We got sixes. Starting with our swings. Knees soft. Hips back. Here we go. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And park it. Let's walk it out. Good. Hands down. Eyes on the floor. Walk out to that plank. Come on back. Just touch those toes, walk it out again. Keeping that core tight, keep that belly button pulled up into the spine to support that back. We've got three down, three to go. Once we are done these walkouts, we have our six squats with or without weight. That's it, come on, we got one left. Grab those weights if you're using for your squats. We're gonna do six, roll those shoulders back, here we go. Six, five, four, three, keeping those eyes up, two, one more. Mountain climber crunch, three left, three right, hit the deck, here we go. Draw that belly button up, set it back. Good. You got it. Arch that back up. Two more, one on each side. And then we're back to our eight swings. Perfect. Find your dumbbell, find your kettlebell. Knees soft, hips back. Here we go. Eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, last one, and park it. Perfect. Whoo, walk out. Just about forgot, here we go. Walk it out to plank. Keeping that core tight, eyes on the floor. We have eight total. You got it, you got it. Woo. How are your shoulders doing? All right, four down. Four to go, come on. We've only got one round left of all of these exercises, and then we're done. That's it, come on, two more, two more, two more. And then we're 
Mountain climber crunch. Four left, four right. All right, if you need to make this a bit easier, elevate your hands off the floor. We're coming down, here it is. Eight, set it back. Seven, woo, six. Really think about what those abs are doing. Picture it in your head. Woo, I think we got two left. And last one. Awesome, we got tens. Last round, let's give it all we got. Knee soft, let's push those hips back. Ten swings, here it is. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, whoo, park it. Nice work. Walkouts, the last time. Oh, we got 10 of them, here we go. 10. Eyes are on the floor. Nine, keep that belly button pulled up into the spine. Eight, watch that those hips don't drop in the bottom position. Excellent. 
legs. Coming back up onto those hands, flexing that back foot. Hips are going to come up. We're going to bring the other leg up towards the ceiling. Bring that knee to the same wrist. Slide that leg back. Staying up nice and tall or working your way down closer to the floor. Working your way back up. Flexing that back foot. Getting those hips up. Woo. We're going to walk those feet towards the hands. We're going to hang like a right dog. Separating those shoulder blades from a nice mid back stretch. And then slowly start to stand it up. Vertebrae by vertebrae. Bringing those shoulders down and back. We're going to interlace those hands and open up through the chest. Keeping those shoulders down. Sticking that chest out as much as you can. Excellent. We're going to give ourselves a nice big old pat on the back. We're going to push that elbow back with the hand. Nice quick tricep stretch. Switching sides whenever you're ready. And then we're going to go into a quad stretch. So if you need to hold on to something for balance, find a wall or a chair. Grab onto an ankle. Bring those knees together. Push that hip forward. And then we'll do the same thing on the other side. Grab that ankle, knees together, push that hip forward, 